Hello, my name is Barry Graham, golf course superintendent, Wildcat Cliffs Country Club in Highlands, North Carolina. We're here today to discuss proper divot replacement and ball mark repair. Here at Wildcat Cliffs, we replace all of our divots. We like to put them back in exactly as they were removed. Lightly sand, step down. What we're trying to do is get it as close to the original as possible. But the one thing we never do is put sand underneath the divot as it prevents it from rooting properly. When you go to repair a ball mark and you have the piece that was removed by the ball, we don't want to replace that because most likely it will not survive. What we'd like to do is pull the ball mark back, pull it over, and pull it in to try and fill the void left by the piece removed and then tap it down with your putter trying to get it as close to the original conditions as you can. When you have a ball mark in the collar, what you'd like to do is take your putter, trying to smooth it up back in the direction that it came from, just to make it smoother for the golfer that's going to come along behind. 